Welcome to iLecture Online, and here's another example of how to work with problems that deal with direct and inverse variation, or as we sometimes call, where we do problems involving proportionality. And in this case, we have y varying inversely as x, or you can say y is proportional to the inverse of x, and when y is equal to 1.8, uh, or when x is equal to 0 0.3, y is equal to 1.8. And so what we're trying to do here is come up with the constant of proportionality and the equation that describes the relationship between x and y given the following information. All right, so we can write that y is proportional to 1 over x. What this means is that y varies inversely as the variable x, so y is proportional to the inverse of x. And to turn that into an equation, we have to then introduce a constant of proportionality, so y is equal to k, times 1 over x. And now to find the value for k, we have to plug in the values for y and x that we were given. So when, when x is equal to 0 0.3, y is equal to 1.8. And so of course we now want to multiply both sides by 0 0.3 to isolate k. So this cancels out and we have k is equal to 3 times this. That would be uh, uh, 3 times 8 is 24, that's 5.4, or 0 0.54 equals k. So now we have the proper value for k. We can plug that back into our equation, and so we have y is equal to 0 0.54 times 1 over x, or simply written, y is equal to 0 0.54 over x, and that's the equation that relates the variable x to the variable y, given the variation, in this case inverse variation, with the particular values for x and y. Okay, and that's how you solve this. I'm now going to show you some word problems that involve this kind of technique and how to solve them. Again, finding the proportionality, turning them to occasions, finding the value for the constant of proportionality, and then solving for what is asked for. So, let's give some of those a try now. 